Dan Quinn, uh, new head coach of the Washington Commanders, what he sees when he looks at Deshaun Watson on tape. The Cleveland tape, you know, from last season and from this season are the ones that we use. Um, I think we all know, like, Deshaun's ability to get outside the pocket and convert and create in that way. So anytime a player is a dual threat of runs and passes and, you know, can convert throwing it or with their legs, like, that's a big deal. Uh, they've got a number of weapons, you know, on their offense. And so, you know, not just, you know, directed to him, but each game, you know, game plan a little bit different. How do you go about it? Um, our own team has a quarterback that gets outside the pocket and <laughs> makes a lot of plays. So we like doing competitions even at practice. You'll see that today. You'll see that tomorrow where we just go the ones against the ones. And we feel like that sharpening of one another is really an important part of what we do where the offense goes against the defense. We do it in the, tomorrow again in the red zone. Today there will be some third downs for that. It's not game plan specific towards Cleveland, and it's just – us against us, you know, having to guard Terry and keep try to keep Jaden contained, and here's a blitz package. All of that goes into, you know, getting yourself ready to play a quarterback. We're fortunate that our own style is able to, you know, lean into that. And Jaden Daniels' running ability is concerning because that type of quarterback has created issues the last two years uh, for the Browns. Yeah, it, mobile quarterbacks and jet sweeps, and they've got some guys that can do both of those things, have kind of been the Achilles heel for uh, Jim Schwartz's defense these last couple of years. And it's just like outside of Lamar Jackson, I think the most talented runner at quarterback is probably Jaden Daniels. I know he's just a rookie, but when you look at the pure speed and athleticism that he has and just how elusive he is in the open field and making people miss – he's right up there with the best and you've got a, a defense that has just not been able to handle those sorts of things. And they break down and they send all out blitzes and leave people wide open. And then they just don't know how to react to these mobile quarterbacks in the open field. Uh, you would think they'd be a little bit better. I mean, Dan Quinn kind of talked about that getting to practice against a mobile quarterback, though I understand Daniel's athleticism is on a different level than, than Watson's, but They've got to find a way to just be smart. I know they love to be aggressive, but this is not a game to be overly aggressive or you'll get or they will be able to exploit those issues.